The Crown Princess offers three different tiers of dining in terms of price. The complimentary, which is the free dining that is included in your cruise fare. The casual dining, which is a moderate cost. And then specialty dining, which is more of a premium cost. These are all offered on the Crown Princess and let's go check out all these venues. The dining rooms are located on decks five and six. They offer dinner every night and usually on sea days, lunch and breakfast as well. Unlike most cruise lines, there are no set dining times for anybody. You can set up in your app a set dining time if you want to dine at the same time every night, but you don't need to, you can change it however you want. This allows for so much more flexibility than just having a set dining time, say at 5 p.m. every night, even if you don't want to eat at that time. Also on deck five is the International Cafe and they are open 24 seven. It is amazing to be able to quickly grab some bites to eat if you are hungry. In the morning, they offer like egg sandwiches and wraps and yogurts. And then later on in the afternoon, they offer some more dessert things and some different types of sandwiches as well. Up on deck 15 is where you'll find the rest of the food like Salty Dog Grill, which offers a variety of different hamburgers and fries. It's not quite quick service because you have to order it and then wait for them to page you, but it is a good option if you're wanting to sit on the pool deck. They have veggie burgers as well if you are vegetarian and their fries are the best on the ship, in my opinion. You can also grab some soft serve ice cream from Coffee and Cones. The coffee is not included though. And right next to it, you can pick up some pizza from Slice. They usually offer two different types of pizza a day. Also on the Lido deck is the Cafe Caribe and the Horizon Court. These are buffets that are accessible for the majority of the day. Unlike other cruise lines, they don't close. They kind of just switch between sides depending on the time of day. They offer a full breakfast, lunch, and dinner option, as well as snack times in between. The snacks have less options, but there's still plenty to eat. For our Alaska cruise, they also offered a Crab Shack specialty dining that was an extra cost over in the Cafe Creep, but we never partaked in any of that. We just enjoyed the free dining instead. Just like in the main dining room, there is helpful staff walking around to give you drinks or anything that you might need. It's not exactly a venue, but first up is the Ocean Now Delivery. This allows you to get food delivered to you anywhere on the ship. We love this. It was a one-time charge for the entire cruise and we used it a lot. In the evenings, the Wheelhouse offers the Salty Dog Gastro Pub. This is a price per item menu and offers some like pub kind of fare. If you're looking for a steakhouse, check out the Crown Grill. This is one of the restaurants that for one set price, you get your entire meal. One of the most popular venues and one that I would be most likely to eat at is Sabatini's. This is the Italian restaurant. It's 5 million courses for one set price and it seems amazing. On select evenings in Cafe Caribe, they do offer a seafood multi-course meal. On Alaskan cruises, they offer seafood directly from Alaska. Go check out this video right here if you're cruising on the Crown Princess and want to know more about the ship.